Hey everyone, it's Mike with Overland Scout Channel. Welcome to the channel. So today I have a few products from uh, Bouge RV that I want to review for you guys. I have their uh, portable water tank heater, I have their camping lantern, and I also have their Rocky refrigerator, which is their newest fridge in their, uh, their fridge lineup. So I've been working with uh, Bouge RV now for I think probably about four or five months now. They sent me some products to review for them, finding them to be high quality, um, especially for the price point, and it's been really nice working with them. So I'm proud to bring this to you guys. Uh, they're also running a huge sale right now, but if you use my codes, you can actually get a little bit better uh, deal um, than what they actually have on their website till December 5th. So it's the perfect time to get one of these things if you've been on the fence. All right, so first up is our portable water tank heater. If you're anything like me, I like the idea of having uh, hot water out there doing dishes, washing your hands, uh, taking showers, especially on those, those longer runs. Um, I've used a few different systems, you know, but I either, either A, they're too bulky um, or just don't quite work right. So they're sitting over here on my shelf. So this thing is nice and compact. It fits perfectly in my rig. Uh, has a chargeable battery on the inside. It lasts like 60 minutes and some guys were doing some testing and it actually lasts longer than that. Um, so, I mean, that should last you a good weekend here. Um, and then also you would have the AC charger and then a DC charger too for when you're out on the trail if it wasn't fully charged. Um, and then it just takes the standard one, uh, you know, one pound uh, green propane tanks that just screw on here in the back and I'll show you that here in a minute. All right, guys, so I'll show you guys how to assemble this. So it's got the water pump assembly here. So this end, obviously, is going to go into your water tank. And then this, you're actually going to connect into the, the system here. So go on ahead and unscrew it. Just go on ahead and drop it in. And connect it here. And then the power cord goes into the pump spot slot plug. Okay, next up you want to assemble the uh, shower head. So it comes with these uh, two O-rings and you're going to want to place one of those in uh, this, this side here. And then you'll just take your shower head, screw it in and that'll keep it from leaking. There's, also, there's another one in there but it needs that, that little bigger one too to make sure it doesn't leak all over. Alright, once you got that all assembled, then you'll just go to uh, the red connection here, the water out. like that. All right, next up, you're gonna to wanna to take the gas regulator and screw it into the, the inlet back here. Okay. All right, then insert your uh, one pound pro standard propane tank here. All right, once you got it assembled and you're ready to use it, you just flip this side up. There's a button down here on the propane side. You just flip that to on and you're ready to go. All right, guys, once you got everything all set up and um, complete there, you'll just go on ahead and hit the on button. Your LCD display will come on. It's nice, crisp and clean. It's got all your uh, indicators in here. It's got your battery level, water temperature on the left here is for the tank. And then this is the water temperature that's coming on. And then it's got all your other ignition icon, water level, uh, uh, water status icon, uh, your voltage, and then it's also got the uh, overheat uh, symbol in there too. So if you want to heat the water, you just hit the pump button uh, quickly. Um, if you just want water to pump out, you'll actually long press it. So we want to warm it up though. Um, so I'll just press once. It ignites the system here. And then you can adjust your, your uh, level of the temperature. So right now I got a pretty, let's go medium to high. Uh, max is going to be 120 uh, degrees. Once you're ready to spray, you just hit the button here on top. And you can switch through your different levels here. It's a longer stream. Those are the three levels. And then as you can see on the display, it's coming out at 95 degrees. All right, that's the review for this one. It's a really nice unit. Um, you know, every now and then you come across a piece of kit that's like a little game changer for you. And I think that's what that, this is gonna be for me. So it's nice and compact and it's gonna be nice having some hot water out there. So yeah, Bouge RV, man, you guys are coming up with some really good stuff here. 
So on that, we'll switch over and uh, we'll do the light. All right, here we go. All right, guys, moving on to the camp light. So first and foremost, nice and compact. Look how small that thing is. So legs are easier to deploy. It's got a nice little base, rise this up a little bit. So you have four different lights. They just flip out. You hit the button once, you get one light, then it's two, three, four, now you got all four on. You have different bright uh, levels, brightness levels. You can adjust these however you need. You can switch to a white light, some soft white light. It's got some flashing just in case you need a little distress signal there. A little bit slower flashing and back to amber. So I use it in amber. So the white light, you know, maybe you need to fix something and you need, a, you need some bright light. So uh, put it on the white light. Um, you get the little bit of softer white light if needed. And those are going to attract the bugs though. So that's why I like to use the amber, uh, the amber lights there. But it goes up to 40 some odd inches too. And I was using that in camp. I mean, that was more than enough to, uh, to uh, light up the camp where I needed it to. But then it's also just nice and compact enough that you can bring it into the tent. You also have a flashlight at the end of it. So if you need to, use it as a flashlight. It also acts as a battery bank so that uh, you, it's got a USB-A on the back and then it also has a USB-C. So it works good around camp. I, I used it around camp, it, it did great there. And then you can also put it in the tent. It's just so small, easy and portable. So that's pretty, that's it. Just a nice and simple and it works. All right guys, last but not least, the Rocky fridge. So this isn't gonna be a comprehensive review. I've already done one of those. So I'll put a link so that you guys can check that out. This will be more of an update. So uh, in a nutshell, this thing I've put through the ringer and it is 100% earn a spot in my kit. So, I mean, the build quality, it's as if I pulled it out of the box. I mean, the latches, everything just works perfectly. Um, I mean, they, they knocked that out of the park in the quality here. You know, some of the features that I really enjoy. So, I mean, it is a dual range of fridge, right? So you can have a freezer on one side, you know, or a fridge on the other, um, or freezer or, or fridge, the whole thing. So I, I, I use the, uh, the, the partition, um, and then I have one side colder um, than the other. So I put all my drinks that I'm rotating through, I put them in the cold side so they get cold real fast. And then all my stuff, I just want one temperature, I keep it on there. So that's working out great. Um, so the interface, so the interface looks great. It works great. Um, however, what I found is I just use the app. So it's the Bluetooth. Um, you know, when I first got, it, it's like, well, is it going to work? Is it going to have connection issues? You know, like sometimes things do, it works every time. So, I mean, it's very responsive. So that's the way I use it. You know, even when it's not on sale, um, it's at a good price point for what you're getting with all the features and just the build quality. Um, however, they're running a sale right now, but they even gave me another code. Um, so if you use my code, you can get 50% off. This thing's like 600 bucks. Um, you can get it for $300. That code's good till December 5th. So yeah, I'm not sure you're going to see that again. 50% off. Um, that includes the battery too. So you can get 50% off the battery and 50% off the fridge. Um, and then it's 25% off for the water tank. Um, and the uh, the camp lantern. So I'll put those those links down in the description. So happy to bring this review to you. Hope you thought it was useful. We'll see you guys out on the trail.